Prairie chickens are a special symbol of Kansas. Though they're found elsewhere, our state is the greatest stronghold of these handsome game birds. They have largely disappeared from their former American range with the loss of grassland and prairie habitat. And birders travel across America to see Kansas prairie chickens on their spring booming grounds. Kansas is home to both prairie chicken species. The graders, characterized by orange vocal sacs and their beautiful haunting booms, and lessers, a southwestern species with red vocal sacs and bubbling gobbles. Graders are common in the tall grass prairie of the Flint Hills in east central Kansas and the Smoky Hills of north central Kansas. Lessers inhabit the mid and short grass prairies of southwestern Kansas. Both species need large expanses of open grassland habitat to thrive. At the last rough count, about 100,000 prairie chickens represented the Kansas spring breeding population. Of that, lessers made up about 25%. Prairie chicken courtship on Lex is one of nature's finest shows. The first males arrive at the crack of dawn, immediately defending the perimeters of a small dancing area they've established since the previous fall. A large greater chicken leg may hold more than 40 breeding birds, but booming grounds of lesser chickens are usually much smaller, holding on average a dozen birds or so. Male chickens dance in a peculiar ritual, stomping their feet and advancing as they boom. These sounds can be heard for a mile or more on calm mornings. Flutter jumping is an odd courtship behavior where males jump high in the air, flapping their wings. This is repeated again and again in each male's own small arena, and it's an eye-catching attractor. The combination of sight and sound makes a prairie chicken lek easy for hens to find. Constant squabbling occurs as adjacent males defend their unseen borders. Usually these are beak-to-beak -beak disagreements that end with a tense truce. But not uncommonly, fighting occurs. Battles, usually momentary, but sometimes serious and lasting for ten minutes or more, involve beaks and claws. An attacker may grab a beak full of his opponent's feathers, ripping them out. The lek is often littered with evidence of this fighting. Hens arrive by flying into the lek perimeter and then walking into its center. As they go, each male dances this way and that to show the hen every angle of its display. At its peak, the cock may drop, spread its wings, and stretch its head on the ground. The hen may feed, mostly ignoring her suitors, or may simply watch. When she chooses to mate, she squats, spreads her wings, and mating quickly occurs. Then she leaves the lek and returns to her nest to lay an egg. Prairie chickens lay about a dozen eggs with average incubation dates starting in early May. Renesting is common when necessary through late May and even June, so the lek remains active for several months in spring. Prairie chickens a treasure of the Kansas outdoors. I'm Mike Blair for Kansas Wildlife and Park.